Now, Storm Team 2 Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis with the Miami Valley's certified most accurate forecast. All right, well, tonight we are looking at a taste of fall in the air. We have some cool nights, pleasant days on the way all the way through Thursday. Then it starts getting a little warmer after that. A long stretch of dry weather. It doesn't look like we'll see much of a chance of rain until about Monday of next week. And uh, even that's a very low chance at this time. Temperatures are going to stay below normal. Uh, that'll be for a few days, at least up through Thursday. Even Friday morning, I think our low will be running a little bit below normal. But after that, we start to warm up, get some hotter conditions for the upcoming weekend. Our forecast this evening, 71, 7 o'clock with 66 at 9, down to 62 at 11. So it's going to come down quickly this evening. Uh, 50s for the overnight lows, 56 at 8 a.m. and mostly sunny with 67 at noon and 74 degrees at 5 p.m. with partly cloudy skies. Uh, look for those 60s this evening. You'll probably need a light jacket after sunset if you're out and about. And then down into the 50s tomorrow morning, 54 at 6 a.m. And then the high temperatures tomorrow should be up around 70 north at Wapkinetta, Sydney, Bell Fountain, Urbana, Springfield over to Greenville. It looks like we'll make it up into the low to mid 70s here around the Dayton area. And those numbers tomorrow are going to be running about 10 to 15 degrees below normal over the area. Uh, Wednesday afternoon, more of the same. Looks like mostly low to mid 70s, maybe a degree or so warmer here for the Dayton area. Goodwill Auto Auction camera. The clouds coming right at you. The winds have been out of the north today. Uh, you can see the scattered clouds now with partly cloudy conditions over downtown Dayton. We've had some blips on the radar, mostly looking at some cloud elements there. But I suppose there could be a spotty raindrop early this evening over the next hour or so. But otherwise, we're checking out dry weather building in, high pressure coming in across the western Great Lakes, the northern Plain states. Pumping down a little taste of early fall weather. How about 74 for you right now with a north wind at 12. 57% for the relative humidity. Dew points have dropped into the upper 50s. And boy, we've got a bunch of weather checkers reporting tonight. Vicki Sifke in New Carlisle at 73 degrees. Uh, Hope Quilke in Bellbrook, 76. Tom Wyckoff in Springfield, 72. David Wessler over in New Paris, one of the cool spots at 69. And there were some overnight showers around the area, a hundredth of an inch of rain out at Dayton International. Future track forecast map will stay mostly clear tonight. Get back to partly cloudy skies tomorrow, then clear it out again tomorrow night. And we expect a lot of sunshine around the area on Wednesday and for that matter, the rest of the week. Tonight, mostly clear. It'll be cooler, low 54, north wind 5 to 10. Sunset this evening at 827. Partly sunny, looks like a pleasant day tomorrow. We should make it up to 74 in the afternoon. And Wednesday, a cool morning, almost chilly, upper 40s with a high of 75. Uh, there's that cool start Thursday at 50 with a high of 80. And then finally starting to warm up on Friday, a high of 86, sunny skies. And then more heat by early next week as we get up near 90 that very low chance of rain on Monday.